Welcome to Gen Drago Gaming, guys. Today, I'm showing you the Dragon Party deck combo that you have a blast with in 2v2s with your friends. I want to thank Clash with Ash for playing with me, guys. If you have not seen him, he's an amazing YouTuber, amazing streamer. His information will be in the comment section below. But here's the deck right here. Same deck twice. It's a, called a, I coined the phrase, it's a, my Dragon Party deck. I promise you guys, I made Ash a believer. You guys are going to have a lot of fun with this deck. All right. So with this deck in general, and I use it sometimes on ladder, you have a mirror, Inferno Dragon. Mirror is key. Whether you mirror your pump, your Inferno Dragon, if you need more direct damage, your Baby Dragon, if you need more splash damage, your bats, if you uh, if you got them to use their you know zaps and whatnot, or mirroring the pumps. Uh, now, in 2v2s, how this strategy works is it's okay to lose a tower. It's okay to take damage. You just want, but you can't lose the pump behind the tower. And then you go for a big Kamehameha and push a three crown. So as you can see right now, they're, li they're lightning our, uh, our pumps. And that's another thing too, whether they got rockets, lightning, it's a great way to draw those spells out. So if you clump together going up, you can almost spell for you. So if memory serves, I believe my deck is on the right. We're going to put another pump down. And it's okay. Look at that. Another pump. Pumps, 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 pumps. Now, minor, it's fine. Now, when uh, I'm full elixir, I will eventually get to my golem. However, I did want to defend that just because of the Inferno Dragon. So, baby dragon. Bats to, to uh, extract the Inferno Dragon. He's cloning it. We got double Inferno Dragons and a baby dragon defending totally cool now we took a lot of damage a lot of damage and arrows on top but it's okay you see the pumps were sneaking down what can we say another pump another pump bob now here's where it gets good so I'll throw down one golem because <laughs> i promise you you have so much fun trying this deck guess what Two golems. Golem Brothers, baby. Now, one baby dragon. We'll another baby dragon. And just because I wanted to, mirror golems. Three golems. Get our zaps out. Now, regardless of what they have, three golems are insanely hard to stop, believe it or not. They just smash against the tower. I had baddies for the defense, but we don't want to defend much. This is all in. We got three golems. Three baby dragons, two inferno dragons. We make the Khaleesi jealous. Another baby dragon, another inferno dragon. Dragon party, this is what I'm talking about. And another one, the eight, nine dragons, two golems and two golemites. I'm telling you guys, this deck is off the chain. It is so much fun. I'm gonna show you two more replays of it. It's all about them three crown life, baby. And again, I want to thank Clash with Ash for uh, rocking with me on these games. If you have not followed him, please give him some love. His information is in the, the description below. All right, so Ash and I both got the pumps. Pumps on each side. Bats to defend the miner if we have to, but... Now, ideally, the right hand would have, like, a golem or a mirror pump. But that's okay. So we'll start with the golem in the back left. I always start with the left... And my teammate knows I start with the left. So it just helps with the coordination. Can get an Inferno Dragon behind there. Might as well bats on the hog. We don't like defending much, but bats to defend the hog, why not? And it's the Golem Brothers again. So gotta throw out the Mega Minion to try it, to fort the Golem Brothers. I'm thinking I'm, I wanna put down a third Golem. But with that Inferno Dragon, I had the lightning, the archer, and the magical archer in the Inferno Dragon, as much as I wanted the triple. Now we just throw a baby dragon down. Ash got an inferno dragon coming. Golems are pounded against that tower. Now we push you. Push you real good. Bow, 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 bow. Two golems and golemites. And bats and dragon party incoming. Go, go, go. Inferno dragon down. They're gonna try lightning us. They can't hold us. Cause of ceiling. I don't know how that song goes. Good thing I don't get paid to sing. Again, guys, 
it's, remember, it's okay to take tower damage, but get your pumps down, and then you go for a full out Kamehameha. This deck is so much fun. All right, last game we're gonna show you. Now, no pumps on this starting hand anywhere. So, I'm actually gonna start with the golem on the left. I'll follow it up with the Inferno D. Oh no, he threw, he threw the uh, baddies down, that's right. And they zap the three bats for some reason. So after I saw the zap, it's like, you know what, let's push in with the, the you know, let's push in with some dragon power here. But then they lightning us. I'm like, well, stop. That's okay. Throw down a pump. Now, if you look at our hands, what do we got? Two golems. Now, you don't always have to do two golems. One golem and a mass dragon party works too. It all depends on what kind of cards they have. And how much, uh, you know, spell damage they got out on your pumps. And there's goal number one. Goal number two. They come in pairs. Now, Ash has the Inferno Dragon. I do not, so he's going to have to burn a turn, baby. I'm going to get some baddies in front while Ash's Inferno Dragon starts to burn and trying to distract that Inferno D. Going to get my zap. I believe... Nope, Ash doesn't need to have his zap. They're going to NATO us back. They have Inferno Dragons and P.E.K.K.A.s to counter us, and it's still going to be a riot. I thought about Mirror Zapping, but it was on my Golemite, so I'm like, nah. And Ash got a zap in his hand. We're good. There's a zap on the Inferno Tower. And we got Golem, two Inferno Dragons, and a Baby Dragon with some baddies all in that tower. Burned it up. And it was a terrible starting hand, too. All right, my Inferno Dragon's going to take out that Princess. Baby Dragon, Inferno Dragon on the King. Bats behind. They're going to zap our bats. Baby Dragon, Inferno Dragon, taking a minute to find their way here. Throw down another Inferno Dragon. We got Baby Dragon and Bats coming in behind. Coming in hot. And I'm going to try to get a zap on his Inferno Dragon and the tower. Boom, headshot. Nice arrows. So our push kind of got slowed up a little bit here. They were not going down without a fight. So that left tower can die. That's cool. But the P.E.K.K.A. scared me. Not going to lie. Inferno Dragon, why not? Golem to distract, why not? We got 35 seconds left though. Now they just blew a clone. Balloon is uh, bomb damage will hurt the, the Inferno Dragons, but hey, you know, we want the three crown or nothing. You're gonna throw a lightning? That's great. I'm glad the tower died. I want a three crown. Another golem, two golems, Inferno Dragon and Baby Dragon. Let's make that Khaleesi jealous and get them dragons out. Bring them out, bring them out. They're gonna fire a ball. Got my Baby Dragon behind. Now we got spells. Talking about spells like I ain't got none. Lightnings and zaps. Zap, zap. Zap the connectors. Lightning and zap. I'm telling you guys, if you have not played this deck, this is my personal creation. I promise you, you will have a wonderful time playing it. You know what? We're going to show one more. One more. Why not? Again, guys, it's all about the mirror. You mirror the... You obviously, in 2v2s, you want to try to get the mirror the pump down. But with the Inferno Dragon, Baby Dragon, you need more direct damage. You need more splash damage. Can you, can you afford to go double golem hard? Now, they put an Expo down. We just sitting back pretty with two pumps. This is an ideal hands. Double pump, double mirror pump. But try to get the bats on the mortar. It's all right. Didn't work out. No biggie. That Expo's a waste, so we are way in the head. They wasted Expo. And we got three pumps down. So it's the golem at the left. <laughs> and another golem. Golem, can we get the golem triplets out? I think so. Triple golem. I gotta say, no matter what you got, triple golems are hard to stop. Inferno dragon. Baby dragon down. Another baby dragon. We're making the Khaleesi jealous. So many dragons coming at him. Baddies are down. Running through that graveyard. The golems are popping, locking, and dropping those towers. And here is the dragon party with the bats. Can we get another golem? I think so. Golem, baby. Golem and golemites galore. More baby dragons? Yes. 
And it's, that's what we call the Dragon Potter deck. And now it, you know, I can zap it, lightning it. And, and again, thank you, uh, Clash Dash, for rocking with me on these. It was, uh, it was a pleasure. It's a lot of fun. If you guys don't know, we did this uh, co-hosting. And here's the deck again if you guys did not see it. I want to thank you all for joining me on a special 2v2 fun Gendrigo Gaming YouTube video. Again, if you have not followed Clash Reaction, please give him some love in the comment section below. In the description, all his info. He's an amazing YouTuber streamer. You will not regret it. And guys, have fun, man. This deck, you will just have a blast, win or lose. I want to again thank you all for joining me. Much love, guys. Peace.